Drink wine. Drink wine? You know what? I haven't gone out and, and even stepped into a luxury store in so long. Smile. Smile. Good boy, Kato, baby. Oy. Yee, I'm so happy. miracle is this guys it's 6 30 in the morning Sevi has not eaten since 7 p.m. last night he's just starting to wake up and fuss now it's already 6 30 it's been 11 hours so he didn't wake up yet right my boobs are rock hard they're leaking <laughs> so I put a towel here gosh life Shorty's crying, honey. He's wiggling. Huh? He's wiggling. He's wiggling. <laughs> Are you stay with Yaya first? Huh? I'll go to Shorty. Huh? Yeah, yeah. Under uh, my who blanket. Will, who will feed Shorty, man? Has to be mommy. <laughs> Daddy's sleeping, pa. We are hiding in my closet. It's a little bit dark here. You can hear the white noise is still on because Sevi's still sleeping. I came in to check up on him. I gave him a pacifier and he went back to sleep. Actually, he's not sleeping. He's just kind of looking around. He's still two months old and he's doing 12 hour nights. That's crazy. This mom's on call schedule works. I remember I told you guys like I was so impressed with it. I would wait until two months because that's when the baby usually sleeps two months and then I would get back to you and now that he's two months this is his first night that he actually did it straight for 12 hours that's crazy Shorty's a sushi. Shot. Want to eat on his food? Um. You're gonna eat Shorty's t-shirt sushi? Um. <laughs> Is this fresh from the farm? Yeah. Yeah. Not. Yeah. Not. You can buy on this in the car. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Wait. I'll mix it first. There! Then meet my food. After. My buutan baby. Buutan baby. Oh, shush. Oh, shush. There you are. That's you, honey. Say hi, Sky Fam. Hi, Sky Fam. Yeah, that's a young couple. Yeah, hi. Yeah, hi. The doctor said yesterday we went to Dr. Michelle, Dr. Kyang Kyang, and she said that Shati is gaining weight so much because he's eating so plenty. He's gonna be a big boy really soon. But Scotty Boo is not getting bigger, he's getting smaller. He needs to eat more, right? So that you'll become big like daddy. If you're big now, what do you want to do? Use the real bang bang. Use the real bang bang? What else? If you're big now, you want to... What? Drink wine. Drink wine? What else? Drink coffee. Drink coffee? Okay, when you're big, you can do that. So you have to eat all your food. That's your breakfast. So yummy. Beef eating soup. Wow, with goji berries, that looks so good. Scotty has been in a tantrumy phase lately. It's been really difficult. I think last night I was so completely exhausted. I spoke to him, kind of tried to be a disciplinarian, and feeling ko sobrang galit niya sa akin, or parang I was so scared na he wouldn't go to me anymore because, you know, I kind of really tried to teach him a lesson, but not in a mean way, just like in a firm way, which is not me at all. So hindi siya sanay to see me like that. 
but when you're dealing with kids, you know, sometimes you have to put your foot down. Show them who's the boss. Parang feeling ko hindi na gets yung lesson ko, so I told Slater. I think you have to talk to Scotty because <laughs> after five minutes, he just did it all over again. Good morning, hubby. How are you? Sleepy. Guess what? What? Can you turn off the fan? It's so nice. <laughs> then I'll tell you what. Sebi. Slept through the night. Yeah, 12 hours, baby. <laughs> you know, it's so cute because I woke up, I slept so early, like 9.45 na tulog na ako. So by 5 a.m. I was like, what is this monstrosity? <laughs> and then my boob was leaking all over her bed. So I had to like put towel on my boob. And then when I looked at Sevi around 6, he was awake. He was just looking around. He wasn't even fussing. He wasn't even hungry. So cool. All right, guys, welcome back to my closet. I just got ready, finished my work, had a lovely breakfast, and I'm about to head out actually to a meeting. And then I'm gonna spend some me time because this is a rare occurrence. Scotty's back in school finally after so long, so I have some free time for myself. You know, I've been planning to go out and shop for new clothes for two years now, but never lang like that on. <laughs> So today's the day, you know, it's it's early in the morning and I feel like I have time, so push natin yan. Before I go, let's do a little what's in my bag segment. I was looking through Instagram a few days ago and I saw a post of my friends. They were all actually hanging out because it was Nicole's birthday. And somebody shared this post of their bags and I'm like, oh my God, I haven't bought a bag in like three years, which is so unlike me. I know that's completely normal for a lot of people, but you know, this was, fashion was my thing. You know what? I haven't gone out and, and even stepped into a luxury store in so long. And so I just decided to get out one of the bags that I really love. This is one of my favorite bags ever from Chanel. It's not your typical because it's two tone. And I decided to like do a what's in my bag. And this is actually not curated at all because I don't even know what's in here, but I use this every single day. So let's open it. First thing that you will see is dun, 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 a mask that's used. I put it here so it's separate from all the other things in my bag. And then when you open it, there's yet another mask because when you wear makeup out, your mask gets dirty, see? There's a little bit of a foundation transfer here and I'm using the Kleenex mask. If you guys don't know what this is, it's the world's greatest invention. <laughs> Because we wear masks all the time now, means na hihilo tayo. Like I find it a little bit constricting, and parang I can't breathe sometimes, especially when I go to the hospital or I go to a doctor's clinic, and means na walang aircon. It's so hot, which is usually where most of my lakad is, right? So this is actually a white flower mask diffuser. It's pretty cool, and obviously my white flower ako dito. It's so funny because a lot of you guys commented when you saw me put this in my hospital bag. There's always white flower in my bag. It comes in multiple sizes, but I always get the big one. I think this is the 20 ml version, and I'm an OG. Like a lot of you guys commented, oh my god, white flower, relate, OG. Yeah, I'm, I'm an OG. Ever since I got pregnant, actually ever since I was a little girl, I have a white flower in the all the time. So first of all, you put like two to three drops of white flower inside this mask diffuser. And then, let me just take it out. It's super cool, guys, because it's actually magnetic. So if this is your mask, you just put it in between this magnet, see? And it sticks onto your mask. So, I don't know if you guys can see this clearly, but you can twist this. So you open this thing up, and then you get a little cotton pad. I'm just gonna cut mine so it's small. Teeny tiny little piece of cotton. And I'm gonna put inside here. Doot, doot, doot. Spillage, but it's okay. I'm just gonna wipe that way. And then we're gonna close this up. See, so the cotton with the white flower is now inside. And I'm just gonna get my mask, put this here. You can put this anywhere. You can even put it near your nose, but I just like to put it here on the side. Maybe here, up here. Then you can smell the white flower while it's in your. Ah, <gasps> oh, it's so refreshing. Oh my god, this is the best invention ever. I swear, I swear. Because means when I'm hilong hilo na ako, like when I'm out and about, and I feel like I can't breathe because I'm wearing a thick mask, especially yung mga makapal na mask like this. 
this really helps and inside it's just a piece of magnet so it's so clean and you can refill it anytime so white flour is great it's always in my bag because number one when i was pregnant most especially that's when i kind of rediscovered white flour because i was super nauseous especially in my first trimester so this would really help me alleviate the nausea or means and headaches you know i'll just get a little bit then i'll rub it together and i'll put it in my temples instantly it cures it. There was a time when I was pregnant now. I'd always get migraines and I didn't know why. Turns out it was because I erased coffee from my diet. So it was like caffeine withdrawal. This was my go-to to relieve the, not only the nausea, I would smell it like, like that. Or sometimes I'd rub it on my hands like this. And then I'll smell it. Oh, it smells so good. You can also massage it on your back. It relieves body aches. Lahat nagagawa ng white flower, guys. Even when Scotty has insect bites, because you know we live in the mountains, madaming lamo. Um, usually, as a kid, your instinct is to rub it right away, and then he gets so many sugat because he's scratching all the time and it becomes bloody. So what I like to do is drop like white flower so that it becomes mentholy, and then um, it kind of masks the itch, and then he stops rubbing it, and then it can just heal on its own, which is pretty cool. Oh my gosh, it's supposed to be a what's in my bag, and naging white flower demonstration asha, but white flower. Anyway, guys, let's move on. What's inside my bag? Kleenex wipes because when you're a mama, you need wipes everywhere, especially with Sevi. He's always spitting up on me. I have this oil control, which I haven't actually been using so much. This is by Happy Skin. Just because I don't really leave the house for long periods of time. So my, my makeup, wala siyang time to melt because I'm, I'm at home by the time it's melted. Ball pen because when you're visiting the doctor, you need to fill up like health declaration and I like to use my own pen. This one is from Muji. I have my wallet. This is an LV wallet that I actually found in my dad's closet when I was in college and I've been using it ever since. And then we have my trusty AirPods, which are gonna get an upgrade soon because I think it just arrived. My AirPods Max, I think I'm gonna show you later. But yeah, this is gonna get an upgrade. But I like this also because sometimes when I'm breastfeeding, I like to watch shows or Netflix and I don't want Sevi to always be listening to loud things. So I have this. A Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lip Stick. Let me show you. I discovered this color because whenever I get my makeup done by makeup artists in Manila before, this is what they use all the time and it's super duper flattering. I think they said Pug Brides at the Yongo too, so I like it. Then I have this, which was given by my good friend Triksha, and I actually refilled it. Instead of alcohol, I filled it with Kurin water so that whenever I disinfect my hands, I can also easily disinfect Sevi or disinfect Scotty because it's just water, but it's water that cleanses and sanitizes, which is cool. That's a hack for you guys. Kurin water, it's really good. And last but not the least, inside my bag, it's empty na, is this, which is part of this set my friend gave me. It's so nice. And this has my keys so that it doesn't scratch my bag. So that is it, guys. What's in my bag? It's empty now. And it's clean. Outfit check. Still haven't decided what shoes to wear. Got my earrings on. Hubs. Hi. I just fed Sevi Boo. And he gave off a really big burp. Oh. Yeah. A little good boy. Smile, smile. Good boy, Kato, baby. Oy. Good boy, Judkai. Bye, Hubs. Where are you going? Off to the mole. Off to the mole. What are you doing? I'm going to be kind to myself. <laughs> Look, Hobbs, that's my reward for this. Although, Where are you going, Bidaw? I'm going to the mall again. For what? To be kind to myself again. Shopping, ka? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Bye, Savvy Boo. See you later.
Shorty. Hi. Your food source is here. Ilo uban. Huh? Ilo uban. Mommy will uban. Mommy will build in. You go with Amma ka. Bye, honey. I'm Scott. Bring the idea. I'm big on land. You're oh. riding a mass car. We go past that. That's not Bye, Scott. Bye, go. All right, guys. I never thought I would be one of those vloggers that did hauls on their channel just because I haven't shopped in like two to three years and I keep watching this type of content. I enjoy it. I like living vicariously through my favorite vloggers. Although my haul isn't really like Dior, Chanel, Fendi as the likes of what I like to see. Sana kaya ko rin shopping ng ganun, pero unfortunately hindi. <laughs> so, Ano lang tayo? Mga clothes, mga Zara, Berksha, H&M. That's what we have for you today. Um, I went shopping and I'm so happy that I finally got the time to do that because as I mentioned, ang tagal ko nang hindi nag-shopping. And to be honest, like it really does make me feel good to have new pieces that I can style, challenge my creativity. Just something about wearing a new piece of like linen pants, you know, just makes you feel more fresh. I'm sure you girls can relate also. So without further ado, let's get straight on it. So I initially wanted to just go to Zara and Uniqlo. Uniqlo because I wanted to get like pretty bras that are breastfeeding friendly, but unfortunately I didn't find any. So I went to Zara first, which is I think what we saw earlier today. And we have a few pieces for you here. And that makes shin up, guys. First, this beautiful linen polo. I don't know why linen polo is really what's in my head right now, but will you look at this material? It's quite pricey. It's Two two nine five for a plain polo, but I think I can wear it all the time. If I'm in the beach, I can wear a bikini inside, or I can wear white pants with it. It's gonna look so classy, and that's one of the things that I always look for when I buy pieces that I can wear it multiple times, not just once. So item number one, and then I got this dress that you saw me try out. I bought it. It's so nice. It's just a polo dress, but it has a ruching detail here, which makes it super duper flattering, especially me and mommy na malaki niyo chan ko. I accept it. I still fit a size XS though, so I'm happy about that. This is 3295. And what I like about it is that it's so stretchy. This was nice because it wasn't such a struggle to put on because the tela is so stretchy. So this is a keeper. I really like this as well. And you will find a pattern here that I'm gonna make you guess in the comments before you reach the end of what type of clothes I'm drawn to these days. Okay, I have these denim shorts because the last time I bought denim shorts was probably like six, seven years ago and they're so worn out. I only have one pair of white denim shorts and they look exactly like this. I got them from American Eagle but this time I got it at Zara and this one is 1995. And I'm still a size 2 hanging on though kasi masikip na siya sa akin but I'm still um, hoping and dreaming that I'm gonna lose weight and fit into these. They fit me but they're a bit tight. Pero guys, imagine you just these two together. The fabric, the color, so fresh. I can already imagine it. <laughs> Next, I have this one that I feel like is a little bit more baguettes but I still really like it. It's so cute. It's just a plain white denim jacket that's cropped, but it has this really cute print detail on it, which I haven't found anywhere else. And I think it's really nice, like if you just wear a plain white dress under, or if you just wear like all white, but it's yung topper. It's so super duper cute, and I think that I can use this for years and years and years to come. I also got this tank top that I think is really cute. I think it was 895 lang. Yeah, 895. And it's a really simple uh, crop top, but I like the fabric because it's ribbed and it's very, very stretchy. And it's long in front and short at the back. And the reason why I like this is because I'm breastfeeding all the time. I think for the next year, I'm gonna be breastfeeding. So I need something that's breastfeeding friendly. I can just slip off or like lift up, something easy like that. And this one, I can imagine already with my jacket, you know? <laughs> I really like it. Or like with a pair of wide leg pants or with uh, a maxi skirt, something like that. Super duper cute nasha. I also got this stunning dress. It's stunning. Like, I can't wait for there to be an event so I can wear this dress. Um, it's only 2995 and feeling ko pwede na siyang suotin for a like fancy night out. 
it's like a corset on top, but it's covered by a cowl. So it's not super duper revealing. It's a little bit covered but in. You saw me fit this also. And it has a scrunched up detail here, which makes it super duper flattering. I saw a lot of um, viral Zara dresses similar to this, but when I tried it on, kanina, parang yung bil -bil ko, hindi siya matatago. So when I tried this on, and it had this little detail here on the side, like, oh, it's so flattering. I love it so much. I had to have it. And I was thinking, like, this dress, I bet it's like 5K, 4K. But when I checked the tag, it was only 2995 So I'm like, sold. And last but not the least for Zara, I was looking for something for Sevi um, because I felt bad that every time we have his monthly photo shoots, parang wala siyang cute outfit, puro frog suit lang. But they didn't really have anything. And while I was at the kids section, I found this. It's so nice. I was thinking I'll buy one for Scotty para matching kami. But then, guys, it's one four nine five, and feeling ko kasi super sayang pag kids because they really outgrow clothes so fast. So I got it in the largest size. This is actually a kids polo for boys. It's a linen polo. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with linen. It's this, and it's so nice because this print, I feel, is a pinstripe green and white print. Um, it's really so fresh. I think you can wear it with a lot of things, a lot of pieces. Like, imagine this with a denim pencil skirt, no white. So many, so many things, like browns or with rust, the color. It's so fresh. I really, really like it. And it was cheaper than my polo, which was 2000 plus. This is 1495 lang because I got it in the kids section. So if you guys are petite like me, that's a trick for you guys. You can shop at the kids section. It's so much cheaper. Okay, that's it for Zara. Next, actually, when I was shopping at Zara, ang haba ng pila. So I left my items at the counter and said I'll come back for it. And so Slater asked me to pick up something for him. Hi, Hobbs. Eep. What are you doing? And daming mga bagay bagay dito. Shopping and shopping. Come here, come here, come here. Scotty left, by the way, if you didn't notice. Ah, he left Scotty with was your mom. Sleeping. He left with your he mom. Didn't sleep. Huh? He didn't sleep. He didn't sleep. He didn't eat. Wala, wala, lahat. Okay. So, anyway, Hobbs asked me to check some kind of shoe for him at Nike, and it wasn't there. So, while I was on my way, I dropped by a few more stores that were nearby. It's his fault, actually. <laughs> H&M was super duper near, so I said, ah, I'll go to H&M na lang because Scotty is supposed to attend this birthday party for a little girl. And I said, okay, I'll buy her a gift at H&M because, like, you know, cute girls like cute little dresses. And then I ended up buying something that I saw in the mannequin that was so cute. It reminded me actually of the white dress that I got at Zara, but when I looked at the price, it's just one four. So I'm like, oh my gosh, it's so nice. So I had to have it. Look at this. I fitted it. I fitted it. It's one five pala. One five ninety. And I'm still an XS. Woohoo! So it actually came in this beautiful green color or like a black and white. I don't know how to show you guys this dress. What is wrong with Ayan? So it has like a cowl neck front and an X backless detail at the back. And this green is so beautiful. So it's just a normal silk slip dress, but I think it's super duper flattering. You can wear it with a vest or you can wear it with a blazer. You can wear it for a night out or you can just wear it as is with a sandal and it's gonna look good on the day. I can imagine it with pearls, oh, so nice. As I mentioned, it came in a like kind of zebra-ish print, no white and black, but I felt like this actually makes you pop a bit more because the color is so vibrant. So it makes your skin a little bit more brighter as well. And when you're having sleepless nights or bad days, then you know, you need a dress like this to kind of make you look bright and shiny. Bright and shiny, so weird. Okay, so next, I also got myself this bra, bralette-ish from H&M because I really liked the bra that I was wearing, um, which is what I was hoping to pick up at Uniqlo, but I, they didn't have it anymore. It was their collaboration with Alexander Wang, and it's really, really great for breastfeeding or just staying at home. Um, I like it because a lot of the breastfeeding bras in the market are so big and they're so thick because they have these clips that you can, you know, strap on and off if you want to breastfeed. But I just like to remove the sleeves, and this one is super duper thin, non-nonsense, and simple, and it's very, very small, so it kind of doesn't show when you're wearing dresses that are a little bit slinkier or short sleeve dresses. If it peeks through, it looks cute because it looks like a sports bra long and not an actual bra or not a nursing bra. What I hate absolutely when dressing up right now is when my nursing bra peeks out. This one is really, really good. I got it at H&M still and it's 599 bucks and I tried it on and it looks really good. So this one is also a win. So I went to the store for Hobbs and I didn't find any shoes, but on my way back, 
I dropped by another store. Oh my gosh. Ang dami kong nabili. What is with me and linen polos? I got a linen polo again. It's the same one as what I got in Zara, but the fabric is actually a lot more manipis. So this is cute if, for example, you want to wear this black bra under and it's just going to peek through just a little bit, you know? Or if you want to go to the beach, this is actually better because it's not so hot. The fabric is really, really thin, guys. Like, semi-see-through na yung fabric. So super okay niya. And this is 1495 and I got it in a size small. So it's actually the same price as the kids' Zara one. I have these white linen pants. I don't know why I'm in a linen phase right now. But this is size extra small and it's 2395 And look, it's so nice. It's wide-legged and it's garter. So it's easy to wear. Like imagine with a bikini top and a polo that's oversized and you just leave it open. And it has pockets here. Like it's my first time to see cargo pants in the linen. Super nice. We have another pair of linen pants. I know, there's a theme nga here going on. And this one is my usual size 34 or size 2 US. And this is beige linen pants. It's more dressy. I didn't try on these things at Bershka because I was kind of hurrying now because Sevi needed to breastfeed at 1 p.m. So I just kind of grabbed and went with it. Um, this is only 1995, so I just got it na lang. But now that I'm looking at it, it's kind of sheer. So I, I don't know what kind of underwear I'm going to wear when I wear this because it's sheer, guys. Ah, but okay, lang. we'll make it work. It's still nice. It's still pretty. Hobbs, are you still okay there? I think he's sleeping. These are the super cute, um, just cropped tops. I got a white one and I got a black one. And this is great because I go to my parents' place and my in-laws' place all the time. So I kind of need something that's like pambahay, comfort, but doesn't look too pambahay just because when I go to my in-laws' place, they always have guests. And I'm always looking really, really crappy, so I have this to kind of make it look pambahay, but chic. Pambahay chic. And it's only 495 bucks. I got it in a black, I got it in a white. And then, last from Bershka, we have two of the same things. This is just a beige vest and a black vest. Because now that I have a mom bod, I find that all of my dresses still fit, but you can see the bulges here in the side and in the back. So the best way to hide it is just to layer it with a vest so that you can still wear the same pieces but cover the parts that you don't want to show. So I'm actually saving money because I'm only buying a vest and not new dresses. <laughs> All the shopping that I did today in the mall but I want to show you also what came in the mail and this I ordered I think two or three weeks ago but I was waiting for the color silver, they didn't have it. Um, and so I decided to just go with the color green. This is from Apple Cart. I think they're called Mobile Cart right now, but yee, I'm so happy. This is also Budol by, Budol or Budol? This is also Budol. Budol by uh, my favorite vloggers. When I watch them and they're wearing this when they're editing, I'm like, oh, I want one. They look so cute. And so I decided to get one for myself. Um, I can use this all the time, I know, because I'm breastfeeding Sevi in the middle of the night and I'm just like, listen to my earphones so I don't wake Hubs up or I don't wake him up when he's just having a dream feed, stuff like that. So I'm really, really excited to use this as well. It seems like I really miss shopping, guys. The fashion girl in me is slowly coming out again. <laughs> But because this video is getting super duper long, I wanted to bring you guys around with me for today, but I feel like it's it's much too long. <laughs> I'm gonna end this vlog here. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest today, like this guy over here behind me. Can't believe he just crashed my background and fell asleep and is semi-snoring now. Yeah, he's asleep. <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Meets my skin Even with my eyes still